Yes, it's that time once again where we check out Dran Sword. Now, my dude, we're going to be getting into a little history lesson here before we get into some awesomeness going down. First of all, this is a main character of the X generation now. Kamen X just reminds me, I think it reminds all of us of a Valkyrie Bay. We can all agree to that. I have a Valkyrie right here. Like, come on, guys. If that doesn't say Valkyrie, I do not know what does. But anyway, we have Kamen X here, the leader of the Persona team. Now, if you guys don't know about what teams are going on, what rivalries, what Beyblades, anything like that, check out the Beyblade wiki. It has all the information you guys need. Now, this dude right here is the, the founder and leader of Team... Let me just come up here so you guys can actually see Team Persona. So if you guys haven't seen anything or read anything, uh, now you know, because it's always good to know what's going on in Beyblades, right? Uh, he leads Persona. It obviously has Bird Kazami and Multi uh, Nanaro. And that these two characters are actually, actually, in fact, all these three characters are very, very, very awesome. Uh, we need to do some team battles. If you guys have any suggestions of this team persona going up against another team, maybe from a whole different generation, plastic, metal, burst, let us know who should face team persona. Comment down below. But Dran Sword, we're gonna take him back in time and we're gonna put him in the burst generation. And not just to face one blader, not to face two bladers, but to face every single villain through every single evolution of the burst generation today. Now, before we get into this, guys, comment down below. Who is your favorite villain of the burst? I'm going to say one thing right now. Bye. That's enough said. First of all, this guy is absolutely... Which, which other dude in the world would break his own brother's bay and then take it and armor it up and whatever he does? Like, that's just shenanigans. Like, come on, man. Where is it? Here it is. Oh, wait up. I need some stronger armor. Bro, let me just smash you and take it. Okay, cool. I can deal with that. This dude is straight up crazy and I love it because he looks so awesome, man. Uh, but anyway, what would have happened if we got Kamen X took him back to burst and made him a main protagonist blader and put him up against all of the antagonist villains and uh, would he have won? Would he have lost? Would he have been as good or as better as Volt and that famous Valkyrie Beyblade? Let me know in the comments below who do you actually like better? Is it a Volt? Is it a Kamen X? Let me know. I'm, I'm liking both of them. Actually, I'm going to be honest. Volt is the one for me, guys. Like, yo, we've seen so much burst at the moment. Just Volt is just too cool, man. Um, but yeah, it's kind of crazy. This dude isn't the main character because uh, Bird Kazami is with that awesome balanced Beyblade. It's about time we had a balanced Beyblade that was the main character. Well, we did with uh, Achilles, but let's all be honest. It was kind of overshadowed by every evolution of Burst. That Bolt was the main guy. Like, come on, Bolt is always the main guy of Burst. But all right, guys, so we're gonna be working through each evolution, starting from the bottom. Volt and, well, not sorry, not Volt. I see I'm calling him Volt already. Uh, Drans will have to go up against Spriggan now. Spriggan was in the manga because the first evolution never had an anime. And uh, these two bays right here, they always bowed out. So to me, this guy was like the villain in the manga. Shoe, whether he was or not, it doesn't matter. We need someone from the first evolution or first. So Shu's gonna be that guy. We're gonna work all the way up through all of the villains to see how many bladers he can defeat in this epic showdown. So it's time. Oh, he's gonna have to face off with Shu. You know what I mean? He's gonna have to face off with five. He's in trouble, man. Uh, but all right, let's start with Shu and let's do this. Three, two, one, every. Okay, my dudes, here we go. Starting with that first evolution, we have Spriggan in there. It's gonna be first to three points today, my dudes. Burst, pockets out, we're gonna be there. Two points, and as soon as I said it, we gonna burst. That is two nil to Dran Sword. Three, two, one, every. And woo! The first. 
the, no, 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 it was a double burst, but it did burst after. But holy moly, Beyblade X really does burst. First evolution, single layer, Shu has been defeated. Moving on to the second evolution, we have Longinus as a villain. Let's go. Three, two, one, every. All right, woo! Holy moly, guys. Oh, it's a burst. Yes, it is. And it's Louis that goes down, giving a two point lead to Dran Sword. Three, two, and every. And so far, Beyblade X is making these villains look easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Four points with two bursts. I absolutely love bursts. Moving on to the next evolution with the next villain, it's Red Eye. Three, two, and every. And here we go, guys. Let's see what <laughs> we have in store for Red Eye. And guess what? It's a chitting a burst to nil. Three, two, and every. And Guys, Red Eye is nothing compared to Dran Sword. Holy moly. All right, guys. Yo, Louis says, I'm a nightmare. <laughs> Let's do it. Three, two, and every. And here we go, guys. Can Louis get some revenge with his nightmare long on us? They don't call him a nightmare Beyblade for no reason. Let's see if Dran Sword can make it out of this nightmare in a battle. Guess what? He can one nil. Three, two, and every. All right, guys. Holy moly. The attack power from Dran Sword being a attack type is absolutely epic. So much more easier to control with his attacks as well compared to Hellside. But look at this, guys. That is another point, making it 2-0. 3-2 on every. And can we get a burst on Nightmare Longinus before we finish this villain off from Beyblade Burst? Let's see, guys, because we are making it look pretty easy right now. Yo, there it is. He's out of here. Let's move on to the next villain with Hades. Three, two, and every. And oh, oh, he come in, he come back in, and it knocked him out. That is three points. You are correct, guys. Remember the scoring when it comes to Beyblade X. Burst, two points. These two pockets here, two points. But this pocket right here gives you three points. That means Hades has won with an epic knockout and he went in the pocket first and came out. That is insane. All right, guys, let's move over to his brother, Fi. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, let's see what happens when Fi gets in the arena. I just realized I put the perfect version in first. Uh, instead of this one. So I'm gonna do this one next, but now this one is in, we'll just battle with this one. Here we go, guys. Five made that look easy, a true villain. Three, two, and every. All right, my dude. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Can Beyblade X come through and defeat the armor's off? The armor is off, guys. I think that armor is actually gonna take out Dran Sword once again. Guess what? It did! Maybe these two brothers can defeat Beyblade X. 2 0 to Phoenix. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, I really need to connect right now and show the world that we can burst a Phoenix Beyblade. Oh no, the armor protected it once again, and that armor is the reason why it did win. Holy moly. All right, so that one should have been second. This one should have been first, but guess what? We've done it in reverse order. Let's get this version of Phoenix in now. Three, two, and every. And oh, guys, I do not want to lose to this as well, because that is going to be absolutely insane. It looks like Fi is so strong, even with that first evolution of himself. Three, two, and every. And here we go, my dudes. It's time to destroy some villains. Holy moly. Once again, guys, that armor putting in so much work. Can we just get a burst? Dodge movements by Fi. Let him get the win. 2 0. Wow. Three, two, and every. Woo! All right, guys. 2 0. So far to fight. Holy moly. That was an epic attack, but not even the armor came off. That armor is full of protection right there, guys. 
We lost to both brothers from the Chosey evolution. That is crazy. All right, moving over to the next evolution. We have Arthur in next. Three, two, and a rip. And there we go, guys. So far, I think, whoa. Yeah, that was epic. That was epic. That was epic, okay. Count? No, that should have stopped by now. Yes, it did. All right, guys, there it is. Three, two, and a rip. All right, guys, we got a nice little victory right there, but can we continue to defeat these villains now? Holy moly, Beyblade Burst villains. Seems like they are too strong for Beyblade Burst or, or Baby Blurst against X. You know what I mean. One, one. Three, two, and a rip. And woo! All right, guys, one, one. If we can burst this Apocalypse Beyblade, we can get a win. But guess what? It just spins. Yo! Yo, we lost again. That is two, one. Three, two, one, and a rip. All right, guys, two, one so far. Is it time for a comeback? Yes, it is. That is two, two. Three, two, one, and a rip. All right, guys, two, two so far. Oh! We've just been knocked out the pocket once again, guys. I do want to say something before we move over to the next Beyblade is, if you guys remember when we battled this last, we made like the ultimate combo. We left the Morbius driver on. I'm so sorry we forgot this was meant to be a different driver. Yes, we forgot to change it back, but it doesn't matter. He's a villain. He does things to win, so it's all good. All right, guys, moving over to Gwen now. Let's do this. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, we couldn't beat Arthur. I, I don't think we're going to be able to now beat uh, Gwen, but this just proves one thing, guys, that the uh, villains from Beyblade Burst can defeat Beyblade X. Pretty easy as well. Three, two, and every. All right, my dude. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. The big smash attacks again from the epic gimmick of the stadium. I love this stadium, man. This stadium is so much fun, man. I can't wait to get more Beyblade X to see how they perform, but that is two nil. Three, two, and every. Whoa. My dudes, what happened right there? That was insane. You see that big bang armor on there has actually helped it win again. And look at the life form, life form, life, life force from the baby. You can see it's spinning there with the lights on. It's just too, it's still spinning, guys. There's too much stamina to deal with. All right, guys, moving over to the next evolution. We have Lane with his first Beyblade. Three, two, and every. All right, my dudes, let's see. Oh! Yo, it doesn't matter if it was a burst or in the pocket, because this pocket still equals two points. Two nil to Dran Sword. Three, two, and every. All right, guys, can we finally beat? Yes! Come on, we must be able to defeat Lane's first favorite, Beyblade. Yes! The first one is gone. Yes, he has three, guys. Remember that. Let's bring in the next Lucifer. Three, two, and every. And here we go. That did not just happen. My dude, how did that just happen? Let me see, Dran Sword. This is not good to be losing out of the three pocket. No, three points for that guy. Guess what? It defeats us that easy. All right. Look, comment down below. Do you think this pocket should really be worth three points? It's like the biggest pocket as well. Guys, let me know in the comments below. But let's get the next evolution of Lucifer. Three, two, and every. And there it is, guys, trying now to defeat the biggest version of Lane's Lucifer Beyblade. We might be able to stand a chance, but I don't know. It is actually very, very big, guys, and it has a whole bunch of stamina. It's circling us. It does not want to attack us because it is a defensive type Beyblade. One nil. Three, two, and every. Woo! Yo, we just burst Lucifer. I don't think we've ever seen that happen, guys. That is 2-1 to Dran Sword. 3 2 on every. All right, guys, we have proven that we can defeat and burst one of the biggest Beyblades out of these villains. And uh, Lucifer said that's not happening again. 2-2. Two, two. 3 2 on every. And... Can 
Mr. Wee burst it again. That's what Dran Sword is going for, guys. Dran Sword is going for a... Oh, no. Oh, no. We've just okay. lost on stamina. We're losing against every villain, guys. What is going on? All right. This is the final villain of Beyblade Burst. Rashad and his greatest Raphael. Three, two, one, three. All right, my two, Yo, what happened there? My dudes, not even Rashad's bear trap came out. He flipped us nearly upside down in midair to get the first point. Three, two, and a rip. All right, guys, there it is. Can we now find, if we can burst, uh, greatest Raphael. I will say that is absolutely insanely awesome, guys. I would love to see that because I don't think I've ever seen a Beyblade actually do that. And 2-0 to Greatest Raphael. 3, 2, and a rip. Oh, we nearly knocked it out in the three-point pocket right there. That would have saved us. That would have made us actually get the win because I'm going to be honest, guys, I don't think we can defeat Rashad right now. His greatest Raphael really is the greatest. Look at that. The bear trap came up and get... Oh, look at that. It caught my finger, guys. That is awesome. All right, my dudes. One thing that we've proven today is that the villains from Beyblade Burst are too strong for the Beyblade X generation. That is insane. If you guys want to see more action like that, let us know in the comments below what we should do. But until then, we'll see you in the next episode. Do jazz.